Hey, welcome. At last, I've had the chance to get on with the concreting of the track bed in this area. If you've watched the previous episodes, you'll have followed the journey I've taken to get ready for this next step. I have completed the rest of the sticking on of the stonework feature onto the inside of the woodwork. A tedious job, I can tell you. This is now one very long piece of plywood. As planned out in my last video, I'll include here the conduits for the cables joining the track and the local equipment back to the control system. A couple of 22mm flexi tubes will do nicely. After clearing the trench for the shuttering, my willing assistant helped lower the pre-assembled timber work down into its place. Next is the mixing. I'm going to stick with my usual 1 to 4 cement to sand mixture and blend the sand as a 50-50 sharp sand and soft sand mix. I do have an electric mixer but with only a couple of small mixes needed I will just set to work with my shovel and knock up the mix by hand. Getting the consistency right is important. Too dry and it won't flow into the little spaces so the bubbles are less likely to escape. Too wet and it'll be a horrid runny mess. I had to be careful with the vigorous prodding, thrusting too close to the sides will damage the soft card stonework feature stuck inside the woodwork.
Hopefully, most of the bubbles are out and the side surface will retain some of the stonework pattern. We shall see soon enough. The top surface I'm keeping down about 25 millimetres today. The concrete will shrink a little and anyway it's difficult to float a good surface in the rain. I will finish the top layer off next time. All done for today and I'm feeling good about the progress made. I hope you've subscribed and hit the like button too. That would be most appreciated. Thanks for watching and Bye for now.